Okay, so we're given uh, two vectors. We're given the vector u. I'm going to write the vector u down in notation I'd like to use. That's going to be 4 minus 2. And the vector v is minus 3, comma 5. What they want to do, they want to take the vector u and add it to the vector v. And it's pretty easy to do. Just add the results, the, the uh, coordinates together. So 4 plus minus 3 is going to be 1. And then minus 2 plus 5 is 3. <coughs> if you're going to write that in the ij notation, that's going to be i, or 1i if you want, plus 3j. All right, let's look at the key. And I want to point out you're seeing that right over here. Well, let's do the next one. The next one's actually um, u plus minus 1 times v. Let me write that down for you. So u is uh, 4 minus 2. And then it's going to be plus minus 1 times v. That's a scalar multiple. So what are you going to get? You get 3 comma minus 5. What do you get there? Add their components together. 4 plus 3 is 7. Minus 2 minus 5 is minus 7. Let me put in the ij notation. So it's going to be 7i minus 7j. Let's look at the key. See how we've done. And I'm seeing it right over here. All right, let's do the next one. What's next one going to be? Well, look at it. <coughs> it's going to be a scalar multiple of u. It's twice the u plus 3 times the v. So let's write that down. And again, we're not trying to memorize the things, but twice the u would be 8 minus 4. And then uh, 3 times the v would be minus 9, 15. Relatively simple to add together. You're going to get minus 1. I mean, they're components together. And then uh, 11. In the ij notation, it's going to look like this. Minus i plus 11j. Put a box in that. Get my red pen out and see if we've got that. And we did. We got the answer. Let's go to the next one, which is D, the last one. And what does it say? It says, you know, three U's minus two V's. So I can say plus minus two of those things, a scalar multiple. So three U's, again, looking back at what U is, it's four minus two. Three of those would be 12 minus six. Again, all I'm doing is taking the vector U and multiplying it by three. So 12 minus six. Then I'm going to take, um, let's see, minus 2 v's. Let's take a look at that. Minus 2 v's would be uh, 6 minus 10. Add the components together. What do you get? 18. And then minus 6 minus 10 is minus 16. In the ij notation, it's going to be 18 i's. That's a vector. Uh, minus 16 j's. That's a vector again. Let's look at the k, see if we got it. And we're doing fine. Thank you.